by the age of 20, 21, I was pretty resolved to the fact that I wouldn't really live much past 25. Zach Nippenberg started using drugs at 12 years old. His abuse peaked a few years later when he was 16. At that point, it went downhill pretty rapidly. Um, you know, uh, withdrawals became an everyday instance with me. Uh, most of my life was centered around selling, using, and finding where to procure better prices for dope. Nippenberg battled his addiction for 10 years. He says he started with pills and marijuana, but ended up using whatever was easiest to get. Medical professionals say the success of the prescription drug monitoring program makes it harder for addicts to get pills, so they resort to drugs like heroin. Now the Baton Rouge area has a growing problem. Number one, we need to put the bad guys in jail, the drug dealers, uh, but that is separate and apart from the folks that have addictive problems, the people that are using, um, and who are not the sellers. These are the folks that need our help uh, from a substance abuse perspective, maybe even a mental health perspective. Nippenberg says help from others ultimately saved his life. If you're at the point you're watching this and you, you've kind of just resigned this to being your life, you know, give it a chance. If you can't do it on your own, that's okay. There's no weakness in asking for help. I think it takes a lot of strength for being able to admit that you need help. Troy Galden, WBRZ News 2.